Hey guys, welcome back to another video. Today I'll be playing a game called um, uh, All Star Tower Defense. I'll put the link in the description. It's really fun. I have been playing it for a bit. I'm level 7, so I haven't played that much matches. Um, yeah, okay, that's it. I don't want to put the music, but anyways. Um, all we're going to be doing is playing a round of All Star Tower Defense. It's going to be pretty fun. I'm going to do it solo because I don't want other people to mess up my strategy I got. And, um, the strategy I got with, is with Uryu, or I don't even know how to say that, Uryu, I don't know how to say that. But Uryu is, like, in my opinion, one of the strongest characters in the game that is only 3-star. This is probably the strongest 3-star character in the game, and I'll show you why, guys. So, I mean, it's fed, but, um, right now it is, like, level 12. I don't have a normal Uryu with me, so I can show you, like, the true stats. But I'm pretty sure it's like, um, one second, uh, every attack is one second, the range is 17, and the damage it does is around like 10 dam. I think dead 10 damage every one second, so, this is really good. Uryu is very good, it's way better, it's, in my opinion, even better than, um, SSJ Goku. It's even better than that, in my opinion. And I'll show you why. But right now, it's actually in the summoner's place, but by the time this video is published, it's probably going to go away, so... Yeah, only 40 minutes, so... Uh, yeah, so let's get into a game, and I'll show you how OP this character is. Oh my god, it's so OP. I can literally solo any match. Um, okay. I'm gonna take this, I'm gonna go into Namek. Actually, I'm gonna do three, I've never done three. I've never actually done Red Riot three. This is my first time doing this type of um, mission thing. But I'm pretty sure it worked because last time we were flawless with this technique. We were absolutely flawless, and I'll show you how, what I do. So the first thing I do, I'm gonna place an Uryu. Like, I guess right here on the edge. So I'm gonna place six Uryu here. Like, right here and here. And then I'm just gonna spam Uryu. I'm not gonna place anything else. So once I have all the Uryu I can on this side and this side, I won't, I won't place any on there because that's just a waste. And then, yeah, I don't think I'd need to put any here after you guys see how OP it is now. Just watch. Look at it, it's so OP. If you put an SSJ Goku down here, boy, this, it would take like a long time. This is way better than SSJ Goku, in my opinion. But, um, I don't think any powerful enemies are gonna come. So I can place around two. But usually, after I place uh, an Uryu, after I place like around like two Uryu, I upgrade them. So like, if there's like a powerful unit coming, then it will attack it, so. How this game works, if there's a powerful unit, there's like sometimes, zooming into the waves, like wave 3 or 4, there's gonna be powerful units, and to attack them, you need a unit with like, at least one upgrade, so. Yeah, I need to work on getting 900 cash before, like, I think it's like maybe wave 3 or 4, like in the middle of that wave, kind of. Yeah, I sure hope it's on this wave, or else we might just lose some points. Cause I remember if you if I when I spammed Goku, Goku is only good if you're like not gonna spam it. Like if you put a decent amount and put a really good um, ground troops, that would be good. But I don't have any good ground troops. I only have like Naruto, Rock Leader, and anything like that. So I mean it's okay, but it's not that good. Okay, we can upgrade this. Oh uh, yeah, next wave. So I'm pretty sure the powerful units come now at wave 4, at like the middle of the wave, kind of. Uh, I don't even have any emotes. Um, yeah, so they come around like the middle of the wave, I'm pretty sure. So, around this time, they should be coming. Yep, right there. These are powerful units. can only be attacked by... W at least one upgrade on a unit, so only this unit can up can attack the proper units. Okay, next wave, so I can upgrade this guy. 
Yeah, nothing is getting by. Absolutely nothing. I want to place the third area here. Um, yeah, right here. And then we place some here. Then yeah, we'll have six area on this one. And basically nothing will get by. That's how OP it will be. Absolutely nothing. It kind of makes the game boring though, so if you want to add like any more characters instead of just spam, because you will have, after you put Aryo on here and here, and not on there because that's just a waste, you can put like some ground troops to make it like a bit more, not less boring, I guess. Um, should I put some Aryo? I don't know, I'm just gonna. Uh, yeah, I'm gonna put some other Aryo right there. And there. But I'm not gonna place too much Urios without upgrade because um, powerful units can just come here. I don't want to get like stormed by powerful units, so I need to upgrade my stuff. The Urios also look really cool. They have like this thing. It's like a bow. I don't, I don't suggest getting the third upgrade, I mean the second upgrade yet. I'm just, yeah. It does give a lot though. I mean since mine is like leveled up, it's, yeah. So yeah, it does, I don't, I don't suggest leveling up to upgrade two yet. I suggest waiting a longer. Like, I suggest was placing all the upgrade one or you first, and then you can upgrade it. Unless you want to place like other ground units. Next wave. I'm really confident that we can do this. I mean, this is level 3. I've never done this level, so we might not work. This might not work. But I usually do this when it usually works. Do you guys have any other like cool strategies? Then tell me in the comments, but just, if you see Uryu in the shop, try to get it, because it's pretty good. It's pretty good, so yeah. I mean, if I obviously had like a 5 star character or something better, I'd probably use that as a third. But since this is like the only thing I have, it's probably the best 2 star. Boom. Let's put the third Uryu here. So now we have 6 Uryu on this one show. And if you want to do the strat, I suggest you do it um, solo because a lot of other people might mess it up or something. Or unless you find like a lobby that agrees that they will do like ground units while you place for use. Unless they have like a 5 star character. Uh, did I upgrade this guy? Yep, I upgraded them. Um, time to place on this hill, just in case anything gets on uh, fast. Like right there. Okay. And then upgrade that because I can. Yeah, see, look, we're already on wave 10. And we're doing flawless. This is really good. So, yeah, nothing has even gone past by this corner. Actually, no, I think maybe in like the starting rounds, maybe something got past. But other than that, after the starting rounds, nothing got past here. That's how OP you are. And then right there. Right there. And I can at least like one. Oh no! Yeah. Okay. Okay, we're doing really good. Nothing after the starting rounds. Nothing has gone through here, so that's pretty awesome. Oh my god, they're just getting melted. Oh my god, that is just amazing to see. Anyways, I'm pretty sure we can put one like right there. Oh yeah, that's like really close. Yeah, that's like really close. Yeah, so now they can't even get past the first thing. So how are they, how are they even gonna reach this part? I don't even know. I'll put this like closer over here. Uh, okay, there. Yeah, nothing is going to get past with this ultimate defense.
You might not be able to upgrade your Uryu a lot because the rounds will go by really fast if you have Uryu. Because, you know, this thing is just too OP. I don't know if there's a flaw. If you guys see like a flaw with Uryu that you guys want to tell me, then tell me in the comments below. But I don't see any flaw with the combo right now. It's doing really good. Or not the combo, the strategy. The strategy is really well made. It's working really well, so... Okay, yeah, they're starting to get through here, but we have all these troops. It took it took them like 30 waves to get them. Get, like, more than 13 waves to even get through these troops. So. Now it took them like 14 waves, and they didn't even get to these troops yet. Wow. That. Oh my god, okay, they finally made it here after 14 waves. I'm just skipping the waves when it shows up because I'm really confident we can do this. Yeah, look at how much they just like. Oh my god. Like they're melting so fast. Okay, yeah, it might be a bit laggy for some people, so definitely keep in mind because I just started lagging. So yeah, I'm like lagging a bit. My frames are definitely dropping. Oh my god, there's so much blue things on the screen. My flames are like dropping. Okay, actually, there might be a flaw here. We need more Uryu. We need more Uryu. Right here. Okay. Oh my god, this is so amazingly cool. I'm probably saying it wrong. How do you say this name? Are you? If I'm being really cringy, because I have no idea what anime this is from. So if I'm like being really cringy and I am like saying it really wrong, I, I apologize. I probably am. I have a feeling I am. I have no idea how to say that. Okay, we won. There's no way. There's no way we we're gonna lose. At this point, we already won. Okay, mini boss, yeah. The mini boss is the end game. Once we defeat this person, we win. Just watch him now. I don't even need to place down anything. I can't even place down anything. So we got exactly, um. Oh, we got eight, 18 Uryus on the map. Wow. Look how fast we're annihilating this boss. And it's dead. I didn't even reach over here to these are you. Wow. A freeze soldier too. Okay. It's pretty decent. Um, okay. I have some tasks I can claim, but anyways, that's gonna be it for this video showcasing the awesome Uryu the um, strat. It's OP. Uryu is OP. And I'm probably saying that wrong. I have no idea if I am, but it's OP. Whatever that name is, it's OP. I definitely suggest it. Um, let's actually see, okay, um, no, we got a bunch of gems, let's see what we can buy, uh, should I try to get this, I already have this and this, maybe I'll try to get this, oh, I got Deku, this is the co most common you can get in the summon thing, let's actually see what Deku is, is it good? Two seconds, every two seconds, I'll come here to you. Wait, maybe, maybe, just maybe, because it does 15 damage, and it's a level 1. Are you level 12 does only 11.1 .1 damage, but its range is, like, way lower. Hmm. I might, okay, I'm gonna try using Deku. Let's see how much it costs, actually. I'm gonna unequip Naruto. I don't wanna upgrade it. Oopsies, um, where am I clicking? Let's actually see. Let me equip it. How much does it cost? Oh, 375. That's why. 
So it's a bit overpriced. I don't know what it, how much it's how much it's next. Like, um, okay, I'm just gonna research more into Deku. See if it's worth replacing. Um, are you with? But um, let's go to the gold summon and let's summon a gold character. Then we go Baroque Works Agent Three. Um, what is Baroque Works? Oh, is it the thing from One Piece? Oh yeah, there was like a Baroque Works thing from One Piece. I remember. I wonder how we can use that. I don't have any One Piece characters. I wish I did. I like One Piece. Anyways, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. I got to level 8. Nice. It's not that high of a level, but we got there. I'm pretty sure we have um, number 4 unlocked. But I um, hope you guys enjoyed this video. This game is awesome. It's super fun. I really recommend this game. I will put it down in the description below, but anyways, I'll see you guys later. Bye guys.